Ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. I am Commander Lonnie Christian, Deputy Commandant of Midshipmen, and I'll be the master of the ceremonies for today's Regimental Award Ceremony. Before we get started, I would like to thank Mr. Brian Wolf of the IT Department for assistance in producing this presentation, and Ms. Emily Baer in College Relations for her public relations support with calendar updates and social media assistance. Welcome to the 2021 Regimental Award Ceremony. We are here to recognize some of our midshipmen's superior accomplishments they achieved using their vision, effort, and tenacity. This event is also significant as the award recipients have shown the path to their achievement and they will be a light for others to follow in their footsteps. Before we get started with some opening remarks, I would like to acknowledge a few people participating this afternoon. President Bill Brennan, and Captain John Cashman, Commandant. We also have some alumni chapters and a Marine Society present with us that will I will mention a little bit later. Also in our virtual world this evening, we have some families represented who are award sponsors. We thank you for your wonderful support to our regimental students. Good afternoon to all of you. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor to introduce to you this afternoon, Captain John Cashman, Commandant Midshipman for some opening remarks. Thank you, Commander Christian. Welcome colleagues, alumni, families, friends, and most importantly, our members of Maine Maritime Academy's regiment joining us today for our regimental award ceremony presented virtually thanks to the dedication of our college relations and information technology staffs. In every organization, you will find that its members can be split into three general categories. The first category are those who make things happen. The second are those who watch things happen. And the third category are those who ask, what happened? It is my pleasure today to honor a few of those regimental members who are clearly in that first category. I am proud to say that each of the awardees you will hear about would have performed just as well, worked just as hard, and dedicated just as much time to the betterment of their peers without this formal recognition. However, it is too often that we get overwhelmed by the daily challenges we face and don't take the time necessary to recognize their hard work and selfless dedication to others. It is through the support of our alumni, both individuals and chapters, and maritime affinity groups and societies that will allow us to take this opportunity to give praise and celebrate achievement. Success is about creating opportunities, opening doors, and making the most out of the options we have in front of us. Part of those opportunities, both current and future, come from being part of the larger organization that is Maine Maritime Academy. Each of our awardees demonstrates that they understand that success does not come from in the individual effort alone. You need a support network, and this network relies upon the mutual effort of your peers and a legacy of high achievement by those who came before you. The alumni, friends, and families gathered here recognize the value of a Maine Maritime Academy education and the benefits derived from its program, and they have committed to continuing that legacy through recognition of these future alum. For that ongoing and unwavering support, thank you. Now, it is my pleasure to introduce Maine Maritime Academy's president, Dr. William Brennan. Under the laws of the United States, the Academy is required and stipulates in writing that it will maintain a regimental program of study and have a formal rules governing the operation of the regiment. This is our foundational purpose, our fundamental mission, 
to train officers for the safe and efficient operation of the Merchant Marine of the United States. Since our founding, our program has certainly expanded and broadened beyond the training of merchant mariners, but our regimental program of study continues to provide the students, even those not seeking a Coast Guard license, with the leadership skills that enable them to be successful in their careers. It is part of the reason that the Academy continues to be listed among the elite colleges of America. Thank you all for joining us this afternoon. Despite being remote, I am pleased that we are gathered to celebrate your achievements as members of the regiment. The history of Maine Maritime Academy is replete with challenges that have been met head on successfully by generations of students. Your time here has certainly included unique challenges that require perseverance and commitment to yourselves and to each other. Despite the disruptions, you have stayed the course and supported your shipmates. I want you to know how very proud I am of you, of what you have accomplished that has led to the awards you received today. We are Mariners forever, and together we will persevere. Be well, stay well, take care of yourselves and your families. Congratulations. Thank you, President Brennan. This afternoon, we have two alumni chapters and a Marine Society represented here today. The Bangor Sea Dogs Alumni Chapter, the Seacoast Alumni Chapter, and the Portland Marine Society have awards to present this afternoon. The alumni associations and the Marine Societies are powerful networks where being a graduate from Maine Maritime Academy can be very helpful. It is rewarding seeing alumni chapters and marine societies given to this next generation of mariners. Our first presenter is Mr. Jeff Wright, Director of Alumni Affairs. Thank you, Commander. On behalf of the Maine Maritime Academy Alumni Association Seacoast Chapter of New Hampshire, two $500 scholarships are being awarded today. The Captain Thomas H. Smith, Maine Maritime Academy Class of 1967, Regimental Award is in recognition for being selected the training ship State of Maine's Cadet Master for academic year 21-22. And this year is awarded to Midshipman Second Class, Nicholas Lewis. The Paul E. Mercer, Maine Maritime Academy Class of 1973, Regimental Award is in recognition for being selected the training ship State of Maine's Cadet Chief Engineer for academic year 21-22. And this year is awarded to Midshipman Second Class, Jacob Olson. Congratulations to you both and to all of today's recipients from the Maine Maritime Academy Alumni Association, continued success. The next award presenter will be Captain David Sulin, Maine Maritime Academy Class of 1971, and the Chairman of the Portland Marine Society Scholarship Committee. Captain Sulin. Marine Society will award four $2,000 scholarships based on financial need, academic performance, and leadership abilities. The Portland Marine Society was chartered by the Commonwealth of Massachusetts on February 26, 1796, 24 years before Maine became a state. Interestingly, the governor of Massachusetts at that time, who signed our charter, was none other than Samuel Adams. I'm sure that you've heard of him. The original charter expressed a wish that members returning from a voyage would record navigational dangers and other information about the ports they visited. The society feels that we are being true to the original educational segment of our charter through our support of future mariners with these scholarships. Each recipient will receive a printed copy of the Portland Marine Society's history, in addition to the following congratulatory letter. Congratulations on being selected as a 2020-2021 academic year recipient of a scholarship from the Portland Marine Society. Having met the requirements stipulated by the Society's membership, 
you were recommended for this scholarship by Kathy Heath, Director of Financial Aid at Maine Maritime Academy, and by Deputy Commandant Commander Lonnie Christian. The Portland Marine Society, the third oldest active marine society in the world, was established in 1796 for the promotion of the knowledge of navigation and seamanship and the relief of decayed and disabled seamen and the poor widows and orphans of deceased seamen. The society is very pleased and proud that we are able to carry on our traditions and original mission in the form of scholarships to students pursuing courses of study in marine related fields. Therefore, please accept this $2,000 scholarship that has been deposited in your account and continue to demonstrate those skills and attitudes that have led to your selection for this honor. Additionally, I'd like to extend an invitation to you to attend one of the society's monthly meetings in the near future so that you can be recognized by our membership. The Portland Marine Society wishes you continued success in your cho chosen field of study. Congratulations to this year's recipients. Midshipman First Class, Aidan Sattler. Midshipman Second Class, Christian Shepard. Midshipman Third Class, Shannon Estes. Midshipman Fourth Class, Arden Aston. Now, it is my distinct pleasure to introduce our next award presenter, Mr. Chet Manuel of the Bangor Sea Dogs Chapter of the Maine Maritime Academy Alumni Association. On behalf of the Maine Maritime Academy Alumni Association and the Bangor Sea Dogs Chapter, we are very pleased to award two Bangor Sea Dogs Chapter regimental scholarships this year in the amount of $1,000 each. The scholarship selection criteria is a multifaceted uh, with strong emphasis on academic performance, leadership ability, and extracurricular activities. Your selection demonstrates that you have excelled in these areas. We congratu congratulate you on your success, your hard work, and your achievements at Maine Maritime Academy. We know that these attributes will serve you well throughout your life and professional career. We commend you both on your leadership abilities within the regiment and also aboard the training ship. Your willingness to mentor others and give back by volunteering in the community is also very noteworthy. This year's recipients of the Bangor Sea Dog Scholarship go to Midshipman Second Class Sawyer King of Appleton, Maine and Midshipman Second Class Hannah Chase of Warren, Maine. Once again, congratulations. We trust that sometime in your career that you may also have an opportunity to give a helping hand to others in your community or at Maine Maritime Academy. Keep up the great work and good luck on the remaining time at Maine Maritime Academy. Thank you. The Captain Al Brown Award and a $500 scholarship is given by the family of Captain Brown in memory of his extensive history with Maine Maritime Academy, his passion for education and love of the sea. Captain Brown was a graduate of the United States Maritime Academy at Kings Point in 1962. He moved to Castine to teach at MMA for five years in his early years, but returned to the sea as a captain aboard several vessels for 25 years before finally returning to Maine Maritime Academy. He taught here in marine transportation for another 15 years and continued his ship out yearly with the students on board the training ship, State of Maine. Inspiring education was his passion. He loved his students, enjoyed sharing his knowledge of ships in the sea with them. He taught nautical science, navigation rules, and casualty analysis. Recognized by the Maine Maritime Academy Board of Trustees Emeritus Faculty Status, 
Captain Brown passed away just after his retirement in 2008. We will leave you with one of his wise quotes. Education is one of the few things in life that nobody can take away from you. That being said, we honor the memory of Captain Al Brown by recognizing an outstanding student in casualty analysis. Majoring in marine transportation, this student embodies the passion and commitment to both academics in the future profession upon the high sea. We are pleased to announce that this year's recipient of the Al Brown Award goes to Nicholas Raciopi. Nico, congratulations. And on behalf of the family of Al Brown, congratulations again. Our best wishes for your future endeavor. Thank you. The Regimental Alumni Development Award is awarded to the student who exemplifies diligence in the Marine Engineering Program. A perpetual plaque hangs in Curtis Hall with each year's recipient name engraved on a brass plate. With this award comes the opportunity to attend a conference sponsored by Artec. Artec Machine Systems and the Amendola family, John Amendola Class of 86 and John Amendola Class of 15, are proud to present the Regimental Alumni Development Award. <clears throat> this annual award, now in its seventh year at MMA, represents the pride we have for this academy and the maritime community. The academy has given us both so much, and we look at this award as a small way to give something back. Without question, MMA produces some of the finest maritime professionals the industry has ever known. This is a very special $500 scholarship award, which provides those selected students the unique opportunity to participate in a two-day training event, Reduction Gear Drive Systems course. This year, the biennial event shall be hosted and administered by both Artec Machine Systems and Doppelmeyer USA in the fall of 2021 at Artec's Training Center in North Brantford, Connecticut. The award goes to Midshipman Third Class Ivan Corey. For exceptional performance of duty <clears throat> as a member of Delta Company, Maine Maritime Academy Regiment of Midshipmen from 15 August 2019 to 30 March 2021. During this period, Midshipman Third Class Corey displayed his dedication to the regiment's mission and core values by being an active participant in the non-traditional student group, the Student Veterans Association, and as a mentor for his fellow shipmates. Midshipman Third Class Corey has keenly balanced all his academic achievements, regimental responsibilities, and participation in student groups while maintaining an impressive cumulative 3.96 grade point average in the very demanding and challenging five-year Marine Systems Engineering major. Midshipman Third Class Corey's character, initiative, perseverance, and dedication are heartily commended and are in keeping with the highest traditions of Maine Maritime Academy and the maritime industry. Congratulations. Our next award presenter is Captain John Cashman, Commandant, who will be presenting the next award. Thank you, Chief Warrant Officer Kowalski. It is an honor to have Rear Admiral Warren C. Ham, Maine Maritime Academy Class of 1949, and his family join us this afternoon. Admiral Ham and his wife Barbara started a tradition of recognizing students who exemplify the traits of leadership, accountability, and loyalty. This particular award is reserved for a third class midshipman. The award in Admiral Ham's name includes a $1,000 scholarship and an individual plaque. The recipient's name is also engraved on a perpetual plaque that hangs in Curtis Hall. 
This year's selection is Midshipman Third Class Amber Card, a Marine Engineering Technology major from Bowdoin, Maine. The award citation is as follows. For exceptional performance of duty while serving as a third class midshipman training officer and adjutant, Alpha Company, Maine Maritime Academy's Regiment of Midshipmen from 19 August 2020 to 30 March 2021. During this period, Midshipman Third Class Card's unrelenting enthusiasm, limitless energy, and strong commitment to the development and mentoring of the newest regimental students advanced the regiment's core values and furthered the mission of developing future leaders. Midshipman Third Class Card performs as a third class training officer during the summer 2020 regimental preparatory training program was exemplary and she continued to be a mentor and advocate for the fourth class midshipman under her charge long after her assigned training role ended. Seeking additional leadership opportunities, midshipman third class card was selected as adjutant for Alpha Company, a position reserved for students with an eye for attention to detail and excellent administrative skills. Midshipman Third Class Card's character, initiative, perseverance, and dedication to duty are most heartily commended and are in keeping with the highest traditions of Maine Maritime Academy and the maritime industry. Signed under my hand this 30th day of March, 2021. Congratulations, Midshipman Card. Midshipman Card, Admiral Ham has asked me to share the following advice with you and your shipmates. Admiral Ham states, Maine Maritime Academy has given you the tools to be a success in your profession. You can achieve anything you desire if you truly want to do so. Congratulations. Our next award presenter is Lieutenant Trevor Snow of the Commandant Staff. Lieutenant Snow. The Lester R. Patton Naval Leadership Sword is presented to the second class midshipman who continuously looks to further the goals and mission of the regiment regardless of rank or responsibility. This year's recipient is midshipman second class Tristan Walker. The Lester R. Patton Navy Leadership Award presented to midshipman second class Tristan Walker for services set forth in the following. For exceptional performance of duty while serving as regimental operations officer and as a second and third class midshipman training officer for Maine Maritime Academy's Regiment of Midshipmen from 15 August 2019 to 30 March 2021. During this period, midshipman second class Walker's dedication and commitment to the regiment's mission and core values were demonstrated on a daily basis as he repeatedly volunteered hundreds of hours of his personal time to the development and success of his peers. Midshipman second class Walker's dedication to service is further evidenced through his leadership roles as both a second class and third class midshipman training officer in 2019 and again in 2020 in support of the regimental preparatory training period. Midshipman Second Class Walker's leadership development began with service as platoon sergeant, platoon leader, and leadership lab instructor within Maine Maritime Academy's Naval Reserve Officer Training Corps. These leadership billets and experience gained from dedicated service in each of them resulted in Midshipman Second Class Walker's selection as the NROTC Midshipman Com excuse me, commanding officer. Midshipman Second Class Walker's character, initiative, perseverance, and dedication are most heartily commended and are in keeping with the highest traditions of Maine Maritime Academy and the maritime industry. Signed this 30th day of March 2021, Captain John D. Cashman, Commandant, Maine Maritime Academy. Congratulations, Mr. Walker. Our next presenter is Lieutenant Kyle Willett of the Commandant Staff. Thank you, Lieutenant Snow. Today, it is my pleasure to present the next award, the Eugene J. Silva Award. 
The Eugene J. Silva Award and a $500 scholarship is given to a first class midshipman of any rank who demonstrates the qualities of leadership and character as described by Eugene J. Silva, class of 64. These qualities include personal honor, integrity, courage, truthfulness, fidelity to principle, self-disciplined, inspirational, tenacious, tough, fair, and caring in the treatment of those in his or her charge. In short, the leader who inspires others to follow shall be the recipient of this award. A perpetual plaque hangs in Curtis Hall with each year's recipient name engraved on a brass plate. This year's recipient is Midshipman First Class Hawk Magliozzi. The Eugene J. Silva Regimental Award is presented to Midshipman First Class Hawk Magliozzi for services put forth in the following. For exceptional performance of duty while serving as Company Commander, Alpha Company for Maine Maritime Academy's Regiment of Midshipmen from 24 February 2020 to 8 February 2021. Through his tenacity, dedication, and can-do attitude, Midfit, Midshipman First Class Magliozzi earned the respect and admiration of his fellow midshipmen and the entire professional staff. Midshipman First Class Magliozzi rose to the challenge as Alpha Company Commander and led by example with strength and consistency. Prior to selection as Company Commander, Midshipman First Class Magliozzi served as a platoon commander and as a midshipman training officer where he mentored the newest midshipman during the challenging regimental preparatory training and midshipman under guidance month. Through poise and patience, he dispensed discipline fairly, publicly praised others' achievements, personally encouraged and supported each midshipman under his charge, and conducted every evolution with an attitude of service to his classmates while always demonstrating commitment to the regiment's core values and mission. Midshipman First Class Magliozzi's initiative, perseverance, and dedication are most heartily recommend, uh, commended and are in keeping with the highest traditions of Maine Maritime Academy and the maritime industry. Signed this 30th day of March, 2021, Captain John D. Cashman, Commandant, Maine Maritime Academy. Congratulations, First Class Magliozzi. And our next pre award presenter of the evening is Midshipman First Class Matthew Harris, our former regimental commander. The Wedge Scholarship Award is nominated by the outgoing Wedge and is in recognition of a rising midshipman who is taking their utmost advantage of leadership opportunities within the regiment of midshipmen. This year, the $500 scholarship is awarded to midshipman third class William Lebrecht. Regimental Wedge Midshipman Scholarship Award presented to midshipman third class William Lebrecht for services as set forth in the following. For exceptional performance as duty as third class midshipman training officer, Charlie Company, Maine Maritime Academy's Regiment of Midshipmen from 19 August 2020 to the 30th of March 2021. During this period, midshipman third class Lebrecht exemplified the regiment's core values of honor, loyalty, and devotion to duty. By earning the respect and admiration of his fellow cadets, to include special recognition by the Regimental Wedge as their selection for the annual Midshipman Scholarship Award. Specifically, Midshipman Third Class Lebrecht stepped forward to serve as a third class midshipman training officer during the summer of 2020 Regimental Preparatory Training Program. Maintaining a cumulative 3.66 grade point average in the challenging marine engineering technology major. 
Midshipman Third Class Lebrecht's character, initiative, and perseverance and dedication are most heartily commended and in keeping with the highest tradition of Maine Maritime Academy and the maritime industry. Signed this 30th day of March, 2021, Captain John D. Cashman, Commandant, Maine Maritime Academy. Please join me in one final round of applause for all of our recipients this evening. Thank you all for participating, and this concludes today's Regimental Awards Ceremony.